Hello YouTube, I'm Jack Clark, the Eagle Must Steer, coming to you with a Christmas video. Merry Christmas to you, and if you don't celebrate Christmas, uh, happy holidays. And if you don't celebrate anything, uh, happy Sunday. Yeah, it's Sunday. Happy Sunday to you anyway. But, for those of you who are unaware, many other YouTubers, have, a fair few YouTubers have posted their videos and their thoughts on the subject. But, as you can tell from the title, I'm going to be talking about tour bus from the Underworld. Now, I was thinking of just doing like a brief 10 second video of me going, <gasps> meh. But yeah, that's pretty much my opi my my opinion on it. For those of you who are unaware of Toolbus from the Underworld's effect, its effect is as when it's sent to the graveyard, you can target a monster in either player's graveyard, except Toolbus from the Underworld, and you can return it to the owner's deck. And like I said, it's kind of a mare card. It's not as game breaking or as broken as many people were expecting, simply because it was a tour guide card, or it was associated with tour guide no less. But I'm actually quite pleased. Because it's going to be a secret rare, it's going to be one of those cards that people are going to try and get and people can work with. Because, on the face of it, it's a lot of people, I, I assume, will think it's not that good. And I would have to disagree slightly. I, I, I don't think it's particularly like the most broken thing, I don't think it should probably be utilised in any deck. But, when it's sent to the graveyard, so its effect activates whenever it's sent to the graveyard. Most um, most notably is when it's when your Eggsy's monster is destroyed and, he's a, um, and she's a material then the effect will still go out, um, which means you can return back the tool guide that you use for the Xyz summon in the first place, and it will activate when it's detached for the effect of an Xyz monster, which is rather nice and it doesn't miss the timing either. Um, also, it targets a monster in either player's graveyard. So, potentially, with some kind of jiggery pokery, and um, if anybody can think of specific cards that can be activated in, certain, in, in, in response to opponent's effects, what I mean is most is that this could act like a makeshift DD Crow slash um, transmigration prophecy, in which that when it's sent to the graveyard, you can send one of your opponent's monsters back to their deck and potentially disrupt a play. I wouldn't know how you would send one of them to the graveyard in response to something. The only thing I can think of at the top of my head, which is pretty newbie to be fair, is what Needle Bug Nest, which is what trap card that sends the top five cards of your deck to the graveyard if you can manage to mill one off then that would actually be quite good to disrupt an opponent's place whilst milling a load of cards into your graveyard. Whether or not that would be potentially the most practical of plays, or whether or not people can utilise Torbus beyond that, is beyond me. If you do have ideas, then post them down there in the comments down in the comment section down below. I'm interested to see what your opinions are, and what you think this card will do, especially for the competitive meta. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, it's a nice card, I mean... It's a nice, it's a nice target to um, set for tour, tour guide, which isn't a Sangan, and isn't another tour guide, because uh, I. So I guess I would only really see this in decks that utilize fiends, other than, other than um, tour guides and Sangans. Other than that, I think the tour guide engine as it is doesn't particularly need it, although it's a decent card. And if you don't, if you if you don't want to waste the tour guides. Then you can go into this, and if you don't want to, basically, if you want to exes, use this card, I guess. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's a kind of a mare card. Post in the comments down below. What do you think of the card? Do you think it's going to have some competitive impact? Do you, would you use it personally? And yeah, of course, in the um, description down below, there will be a link to the Konami article in which, which introduced this. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm Jack Clark, the Yuka Musketeer. Merry Christmas. Annotation at the top left of the screen will take you to a previous video. Annotation at the top right will take you to a future video. If there's not one there, there will be one there soon. I'm Jack Clark, the Yuka Musketeer. Happy holidays. See you next year.